More clearly than ever, we are the safest big city in America. We know, though, we have to keep working to make this city even safer. And we understand what's happened around the world, and we even saw some tragedies here. The horrible attack in November on the west side and the tragic incident here in Times Square in May. We know we have to do even more to keep people safe. And that's why we conducted a review on how best to secure our streets and public spaces, and we formulated a plan of action. Over the past few months, you've seen around the city in key locations temporary barriers. And that was necessary to immediately secure those areas in light of these new trends we've seen. But we knew we needed long-term solutions. We needed permanent barriers. And that they had to integrate into the life of the city. They had to still allow people to get around. Because these are some of the busiest streets in the world. People have to be able to get around, but they have to be safe at the same time. These new bollards will allow us to do that. We're announcing today a $50 million investment in protective measures, key locations around the city. And that will include the installation of over 1,500 permanent bollards like the ones you see here behind us.